Okay, we back. Are you sure? Yes. I think it'll be better this way. After you, Aloy. Wasn't she wearing something on her head at first? I tried to go back and do some things. It was certain areas where it was telling me I wasn't allowed to go to. So I just said, let me get back into the main mission. But am I tripping or was old girl wearing something on her head at first? I don't remember her having that bun out like that. I need to head further west. To, um, get more of Gaia's components. Make her stronger. You two can stay here in the meantime. And Gaia can help get you up to speed. I'm not trying to shut you out. This, it's like training. Actually, I'm gonna go back east to get Erend. Bring him here. Look, allies, friends can help. Well, you go do that. a place to stay now. And like you said, Gaia can teach us, catch us up. It'll be okay. About time you don't put up a fight. Take these then. One to wear, one for backup. Are you going with him? No. After what happened in the cave below, I want to stay here a while. There is much I need to understand. Maybe by the time you get back, I'll have a thing or two I can teach you. Mm. Looking forward to it. In the bedroom, uh, when will you with Guy. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm not sure. Man, I'll be back when I'll be back, bro. But hopefully I'll have one of Guy's missing components. Don't put no time frame on me. Careful out there. Even in Plainsong, we heard how the Tanakh clan lands are suffering from storms, machines, and now Regala. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. I do this. Good hunting, Aloy. OG Aloy. Big step. The Tanakh clan lands. Somewhere out there's three of Gaia's subfunctions. And who knows what else. Okay, so which way are we going? Boy, they giving me a lot of quests. We going in this direction, so. I wonder how much snow is gonna pile up. I don't know why my screen keep going black like that. I feel like it's loading in a different map or something. Hold up, it said a campfire was close by, huh? I would hate to not get that. It's right here. I need that campfire. Let me take a look at you, stranger. Girl, calm down. If I smack the back of your ball ass head. The hell was that? Race? Well, You're the outlander like who rebels. stood against Regala and her Maybe rebels. If I follow their track. Only if it means we're good. I'm like, bro, y'all talking over each other. I'm not here to drink your blood or whatever you mean. worry about none of that. The slaughter at the embassy wasn't your fight, yet you stood by the marshals. As far as I'm concerned, you're no enemy of the Tanakh. But you are going to need help if you plan on surviving the clan lands. I hear and see many things as a scout. I could share them with you, aid you on your journey. I'd be grateful. Well then, I was scouting northwest of here, near the village of Saltbite. There's a place there where the ground is made of metal. Don't know what it means, but it can't be good. Be wary. Appreciate the warning. That's all you had to say? Yeah, let's sit down for that for. There might be a cauldron. And where there's a cauldron, there's machine overrides. Stay alert, soldier. Oh, can I summon my ride? I can ride the bristlebacks now. So I hack one. Oh, give me this. Oh, 
Okay, let's get to what we're trying to get to. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Slow down, slow down. It's a workbench right here. Let me see if I can upgrade some stuff. Nah, no real upgrades that's uh, beneficial right now. So, how far we got? 1,500. I'll see y'all when we get over there. All right, that was a journey, but we here now. Another campfire, boy. I passed by so many campfires. Turned into a Tanox stronghold. Ether be inside. Poking around's not going to be easy with Tanox warriors everywhere. On my way here, I passed by a lot of campfires. They friendly or what? They friend or foe? Many more soldiers killed since. Vigala's army only grows in strength. Excuse me. Forces may seem strong now. But Her machines took out my entire squad. Remember the visions. Going on with your the face. didn't choose their fight, but still they stood firm. They didn't falter. And neither will we. I see the blue face paint, but what is all that around your mouth? That's paint or you just got a real bad fix. <laughs> what are the ten? That's supposed to mean. Come to us. You know who I am? You've heard of me, huh? Oh. The warrior with hair like wildfire who defeated Regala's champion at Baron Light. <laughs> yes. You are known to us. Mm. I am Deku, chaplain of the Lowland. Deku? You've come to speak with Chief Hikaro. Not quite. I go bore from, uh. There's something I need here. My hero. Anything you need, the Chief will provide. Come. Is that one of the visions you were talking about? Yes. The records of the ten. I can show you them, if you like. On the way to the chief. Oh, brother. What does it mean to be a chaplain here? We who outlast our youth study the visions and share their wisdom with our young. What kind of wisdom? How to be a true warrior. To fight with bravery and unflinching honor. And to know when to call for peace. You can see for yourself when we go inside. Well, let's go inside then. Why y'all making me have all this dialogue? We are at war with Regala. And you've already shown that you can stand against her. I'm not here to fight a war for you. Not for us with us but i won't try to persuade you that is for the chief he can be very convincing you say so these visions you said they're the records of the ten who are they old ones who fought a heroic battle against machines on this very soil long ago their deeds are honored in the visions <laughs> at least what remains of them to be remembered and exalted. There used to be more of these visions? Many more. Once this place was filled with light and sound. But over the years, they've fallen into darkness. Man, what is that bird I keep hearing in the background? That is why chaplains are so important to the tribe. We remember all we can of the visions. Okay, your face the ate fish. up. Passed down by word of mouth from generation to generation. One day the whole grove... Like a dark. bear, a tiger got a hold of you. The chaplains who come after me will keep the memories alive. Well, let's right. get going. Let's go see Chief Akaro. He's in his throne room at the far end of the grove. Come. Be welcome among the records of the ten. You say so, lady. Come, you have a soldier of the ten. 
It's glitched. Incomplete. Joint Force 10 acting at the Led by the Try asking me to fix it. Alright, lady, move on. The ten were dedicated soldiers, working together as a squad and sharing in their duty. And when the time came for battle, they took to the skies and leaped to glory. All Tanakh seek to follow their example. What do you mean not ready? For the chief, it was one of the few things the clans had in common. Alright, come on, man. Y'all just gonna force me into this, huh? During their war, the ten climbed sheer rock, braving blinding snow and wind. They stopped at nothing to protect their own. Why are they not letting me pull my thing out? invincible. They weren't. But the visions tell us of their courage and strength. Something our soldiers aspire to. The Sky Clan admires this one above all the rest. Lady, can you hear them talk? They make their home in the mountains northwest of here. There you go. They wouldn't let me pull this up. I was trying to. One missing from right here, ain't it? Why ain't you just give me the ability to fix these things that way I can hear the story regularly? Hard as hell to understand what they saying with it glitching all over the place. Come on, tell me what you gotta tell me. The ten waged war against their enemy in the desert heat. A land too harsh. And they said ten out of twenty-three? But against all odds, they prevailed. So the desert clan does the same. Who must have passed? Alright, come on, walk and talk with me. Let's go and get to the next one. Did. They sound a little extreme. Okay, that's they the throne. That as a compliment. Hey, Outlander. It said that relic you wear can hear the voice. Soldiers in a jungle. Is this true? Those were the ten. Did you see, yes. I'm talking to her, bro. They knew how to use the jungle's depths. To Rude as hell. Enemy until the perfect moment to strike. Generations ago, my clan, the Lowland, looked to this one for inspiration, as they claimed the jungle to the southwest. All right, come on, sit at the throne. See what your chief talking about. The chief is inside. Are you ready to see him? Yeah, come on here. I see that data thing behind you. Hold up. I want to look around more first. As you will. All right, come on. We can go now. The chief waits beyond. <laughs> ready? I'm ready. Good. Come. I'm ready now. Come on here. Oh, she the chief. What are we looking at, Aloy? It's underneath the throne. Oh, this fool the chief. Soon, Outlander. Man, I ain't got time to be sitting right waiting on you. Meridian. Where your arm at? I am told you held back Regala's forces outside Baron Light. Oh, you the chief. And defeated her champion, Grutta, in single combat. I did that. Impressive. Boy, you out here looking like Shell Khan. <laughs> I met Fashav there, too. He said you were a great warrior and a man of honor. His death 
is a painful Big loss. Big tall, hulk looking there. We will not soon recover from the massacre of our marshals. But if you are here to pledge your service. Boy, I ain't here to pledge a damn thing. What are you talking about? I am not here to fight for you. I need something in that basement. Something that will save many lives, yours included. It's not something you can see, but it is there. I have seen it. You have named your price. Now I name mine. With my marshals dead, I need your spear. Help me defeat my enemies, and I will grant you access to the chamber below. Oh, brother. I don't have a price. I am not a hired killer. I'm here to save lives, more than you can count. I count the corpses of marshals slain. I count hundreds more to knock them, whose lives hang in the balance. I will fight for them. I will kill anyone who threatens the peace, and you will too, if you want me to open the door to the chamber below. Okay. So by that logic, what's stopping me from killing you right now? Huh? And taking what I need to save everyone. Do you want to throw hands? You could try. You might even succeed. Either way, you must fight. My way might hold off Regala and the slaughter she craves. He wasn't as tall as I thought he was, not even walked up on me. What do you need? I need more marshals to keep the He definitely talk like the Jolly Green Giant, though, shit. Such warriors can only be promoted. Such warriors should only be. By combat called the Cool Root. Deep voice, eh? I've sent out a call for the competition. But since Regala seeks to undermine me, she is certain to attack it. She'll want to kill me in front of the assembled clans. So what, you want me to be your bodyguard? No. It's that big as your ass is, you should be your own bodyguard. What you scared of for? But there is more. Big for nothing ass. Knowing Regala will attack, one of the clans have balked at sending their contestants. You must go north and force Tecote, the commander of the Sky Clan, to submit and send his best. Force him to submit? Do whatever is necessary. I can't hold a cool route with two of the three clans in attendance. Marshal Katala will assist you. He was maimed at Baron Light, but he can still be of use. Oh, the one arm dude. I sent him ahead to the northern village of Stone Crest. Meet him there, and he will guide you to the Sky Clan stronghold. If you have any questions about your mission, now is the time. Boy, I ain't got no questions. You, you want me to ask too much. Get me out of here. I'll do what you want. And go north to deal with Dakota. I'm learning not to talk all that dialogue with every goddamn you person. Have what was promised. If you succeed, speak to Decca on your way out. She will arm you for the road ahead. Who I'm speaking with? Oh, Deku. This thing don't work no more. Assuming at some point I'm gonna fix that for them. What you got over here? You have an old world recording? This box was speaking with voices of the old ones. But now there's noise over them. Let me take a look. Bag the hell up. Where did you find this? We took it from an Asaram Delver. She was trying to steal it and other artifacts from Tanakh territory. The others were going to bury it in the sand with her. But then I heard the voices. Well, the data here is badly corrupted, but... Delta Juliet 9, you are weapons free and clear to... But I can fix it with two presses of a button. Copy that. We'll buy Zero Dawn the time you need. Delta Juliet 9, out. The voices of warriors from the past. And that Osiram wanted to sell... I don't know nothing about no warriors, but okay. Be remembered. I'm not sure what you mean by the ten... These voices came from the final battle of the old ones. Another battle? I could learn more about it if I could find the other boxes. Well, you do that. That Delver did say there might be more recordings to be found in the wreckage of ancient flying machines. She claimed she had a way to locate them. Yeah. 
The box with the voice data on it is emitting a locator signal. I could use it to find the others. If you do then, bring them back here. I will see to it that they're treated with proper respect. Whatever sacrifices were made by the others, <coughs> we will honor them. If you say so, lady, get me out of here. I have some already. Let me know when you have one that you'll part with. Oh, I thought I had some already. Get me out of here. If I find more of those recordings, I'll bring them back to you. My focus can detect beacons from those recording devices. Should help me to find any others that are still out there. Come, let us speak. Well, speak then. Hikaru said you have something for Speak me? or forever hold your peace. Your mission. You'll need it for the long road to Stonecrest. Hell is it is. machines prowl along the way, and our scouts have sighted Regala's rebels in the area. Machines and rebels. Nothing I haven't faced before. Basically. Indeed. Head north towards the foothills. Ascend its slopes until your legs burn and the chill air catches in your chest. Then you'll okay. in the Sky Clan's domain. Strike true as the ten, Aloy. You say so, lady. If I'm gonna get ether, guess I'll have to play along with Akaro. I better meet up with Marshal Katala. Ah, damn, boy, you've been doing a lot of digging. Be faster if I ride a machine. I already got a machine to ride, Aloy. We rode over here on the machine. That's one thing about having a bristle brat. They dig up these orbs. There's normally shards. And I'm assuming time for time they might find uh, rare stuff. All right, bro, I ain't about to pick all this stuff up. Stop digging. All right, we're going this way. Another long ride. I'll see y'all when we get over there. Deeper, air's getting cold. Should be getting close to Stone Crust. So we pretty much in the right location. As you can see, I ain't on the bristle back no more because we started getting off into high terrain. And I felt like I could just climb it and hang glide down the mountain. That's where I'm supposed to be. Anything good you? This must be now one more step. The Tanakh don't suffer outlanders in My the bad. I was given right of passage by Marshal Fashav. I'm not here to fight. They're like blood. This is the warrior who defeated There the you go. Champion Better put some respect on my name. Her life is not OGA Lord. You may enter, but mind our ways. You will be watched. Man, F your ways. Let's get out the way and let a G come through. Now, in photo mode, they gave me options to put face paint on. But I haven't ran across those options in the menu. So either I haven't got to the point where they're allowing it, or just certain outfits have it, or who knows. Gotta get that. Bro, I wouldn't try to talk to her. Get up. What you've done for my people is known throughout the clan lands, Easterner. I'd like to help you if I can, lending you my eyes and ears. Nothing happens in this area without me knowing about it. If you say so, lady. In fact, I should tell you. If you're looking for some solid rations to sustain you out in the wilds, mm -hmm. you should go to Saltbite. It's a desert settlement east of here. Big Lake. Can't miss it. Yes. There, Pentala will whip up a meal for anyone who needs it. We off in the snow. She talking about desert area. Thanks for letting me know. I'll pay her a visit if I'm out that way. All right, get me the hell up. Wasn't trying to talk to her. Just trying to quick save. All right, now give me to. Where's Katolo? This fool. What's he looking at? Hey man, what you looking at? Hey man, say man. This valley is infested with Regala's rebels. 
The scouts from the village tell us that they've been so what you gonna do about that? here for days. Some they ride, others they herd along, and some they even strip for parts, especially cannons. Oh, you the one arm dude. I'm just realizing that. <laughs> I thought I was meeting the chief in this village. Go in. My orders are to guide you to the bulwark so that you can speak to Dakota. For all the good it'll do. Man, we'll carry your ass back home then, shit. I'm gonna need a little more than that. God damn it, Aloy. What is this place? Stonecrest was built as an outpost back when the clans were still at war. Its purpose was to guard the entrance to the valley, as well as keep watch on what happens below. And for now, that means keeping watch on Regala's forces. I wish we had enough soldiers to do more than just look on. For all the good it'll do? What's that supposed to mean? The bulwark has stood unyielding since the birth of our clan. Behind it, Tecote believes himself to be invulnerable. If he insists on defying Hikaru's orders, an outlander and a maimed marshal aren't going to change his mind. Your chief seems to think differently. And that is the only reason I am still standing here. Well, then shut the hell up, you. then. <laughs> shit. I'm breathing all heavy and shit. Boy, I ain't scared of you. What makes you so sure Takote won't listen to us? A snake safe in its lair hears nothing but its own rattle. Come on, is that all you've got for me? Hikaru said you were from the Sky Clan before becoming a marshal. I need to know what you know. Takote is a petty, vindictive schemer. If he had any guts, he would have gone after Hikaru long ago. But instead, he covets the chiefdom from behind the bulwark, biding his time. Hoping that his foes will weaken one another. So he wants the crown. Is that enough for you? No, you'll stand here and answer questions until I get tired of asking the motherfucker. Why do you think Regala's forces are driving machines through the valley? We've heard similar reports from across the clan lands. The rebels are gathering machines from the wilds, but whatever control they have over them doesn't seem to last. So they herd them into camps. Something else happens there. Something... Something that makes their control permanent. An override with two phases. I... Don't know about that. Yeah, I know you don't know... I know you don't know nothing about that, because that's my area of expertise. The are scouting larger machines. I don't know what kind. Let's hope they don't learn how to override them, too. Hmm. What makes the bulwark so impenetrable? It's made of massive boulders, impervious to any frontal assault. No army or machine has ever penetrated it. I am the only that can get you inside. If we're done talking, that is. We not done talking. At first, I was gonna rush through this dialogue, but just cause you getting crazy with me, we are gonna have every piece of dialogue. I was. I'm sorry about the other marshals. And their deaths will not go unpunished. Okay, now you talking my language. You're still healing. I will never heal. But that won't stop. You right? Normally, when you use lose a limb. They say it's something called phantom pain where you can feel like your arm or whatever part missing still left. It's probably what you're going through, Playboy. Now we oh, could go talk. The, plan. the bulwark is to the southwest. So undoubtedly we'll have to cross paths with Rogala's troops along the way. We'll either have to fight our way through or find a way to sneak past unnoticed. Neither will be easy. Never is. Hmm. Let's get this over with. On me. On me. 
How would you convince Takote to send his challengers? I wouldn't. <sighs> Come on. Bro, we going all the way down there. I can hang glide down there, bro. Like wields it. But does anyone like that? Well, like you don't know how to slide, bro. Players, but let's hope it won't come to that. Hmm. So this whole valley is the Sky Clan's territory? Yes. The clan has defended it for generations. Against who? The other Tanakh clans. Even the Karja long ago. Let's see a campfire close by. Come on, bro. We ain't got to sneak around. Quick save. Oh. Well, now they're alert. Fight with honor. You get here. Huh. Was not expecting this. Over here. Oh, watch yourself. Uh, alarm. Watch yourself. I thought the things explode. Nope. On watch out, watch out, watch out. Headshot, dead shot. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I ain't mean to call that thing. Man, watch out. Watch out. Well, you good? You killed him? Got the target. Headshot, dead shot. Give me your loot. All right, where the last one is? Okay, he over fighting my thing. I want to wait for one moment. Oh, whoa, whoa, watch out. Pain subsiding. Now you fall. There you go, get sneak attack in. There you go. Good. Onwards to the bulwark. I need this. I need this loot. That's all you had on you, fool. I ain't waste my time repairing that thing. I didn't mean to call it. Quick save. Come on. Craft a few of these. Give me that data. Alright, which way are we going, bro? Those rebels were gathering machine parts. Maybe to make more overrides. And Takote won't do anything? Why would he, when he has the bulwark? I grew up behind the wall. It's easy to have a full sense of safety there. Boy, how far is we going? The rebels. What? Clearing. Take the lead. Aye. Boy, I fight with sneak attacks. Whoa, was not expecting that. <laughs> I ain't know the fool's head got damn landmines. I mean, uh, mortars. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Where'd they go? Miss, I can hit you with the sneak attack. I'll take you down. Oh, he spotted us. Hut. <laughs> <laughs> 
Or are you kidding me? I hate you can't move when you... What the hell was that? <laughs> Hell no. Hell no, I don't respect your blade at all. Try and knock your helmet out the damn head. There we go. Cause you gonna respect the blade of my arrow. That shield ain't gonna help you, baby boy. Whoa. Close. Hell no. Nah. Man, bro, how you got that hit off? It's my back, man. Hell no. Gotcha. Told you headshot, dead shot. Hold up, I need arrows, bro. Hold them down. You'll still die. They're done. Good job. Now let's go. Took you long enough, shit. All right, come on. Let me quick save. <laughs> that fight shouldn't have took that long. All right, which way we going, Playboy? I'll follow him. Shit, come on, y'all. Come on here, play, bud. We here? Back at Stonecrest, you saw the rebels have been moving through here for days. By the time Dakota realizes he's outmatched, this entire valley might be overrun. Basic. If not for the sake of the rest of the clan, I would welcome that day. I be having to get all those campfires because they give me a free travel spot. Can change his mind. I want to say give you one one free travel spot for each uh. Let me know when you are ready. Campfire. What you mean? Let you know, man. Come on, get this dialogue over with so I can end this episode. Marshal requests an audience with your clan commander. I didn't know there were any marshals left. We defend the path to the mountain, where the wings of the ten shall find us. All right, Marshal. I'll send the lift for you. Well, hurry up about it. Shit. What are we looking at, Aloy? Eh, Meet with Dakota. I'll do the talking. You say so. We'll see how it goes. Back again. So this was home. A long time ago. Bro, what is with all this extra dialogue? Come on. We already about to have a long ass conversation with whoever this is. Oh no, they 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 got me out the cutscene? Oh, come on. You can do better than that. Look, I'm ending this episode here then. <laughs> so to next time, peace.